how to re your bathtub. I am Stephen Wimberly and this is Working with Wimberly. I'm going to use this acrylic latex caulk plus silicone and this is one of the least expensive caulks that you can get. But one of the reasons I like to use this is because it has uh, easy water cleanup. So if you make a mistake, it's easy to just take some water, a paper towel, and you can clean it up and then start over. Also, once you get your caulk down, if you just wet your finger a little bit or spray a little water on it, it's easy to get it smooth and neat looking for a cleaner finish. The first thing I'm going to do is scrape off the old caulk. And you can do this with any sort of scraping tool or a razor blade. Just be careful. able to get behind the caulk and pull it from the wall. If you're able to do this, you may be able to pull it off in longer strips instead of having to scrape it all the way. just finished going over everything with the razor blade. It was a lot of work, a lot tougher than I thought, but everything's clean now as far as the caulk goes. So now I'm going to use a vacuum to get all of the residue and the shavings up. After that, I'm going to wipe everything down and we can get started with the new caulk. So now I'm going to wipe everything down with my rag. First thing to do is to cut the end of the caulk with uh, a blade at an angle. Also, with your caulk gun, you see there's an attachment here that comes out, and you'll use this to puncture the caulk because sometimes there's a seal down in there, so you do that to puncture the caulk. Once you've done that, Next step is to insert the caulk into the caulk gun. We do that from the bottom first. Slide it over. Push it forward and now gently pull the trigger until you see the caulk coming out the top. And you can relieve the pressure with this button at the back. Also, I have um, a cup of water, which I'll dip my finger in to smooth out the caulk. Have wet paper towel. I have a dry paper towel. That's one of the reasons I like this caulk is that it's uh, easily cleaned up with water. So if you make a mistake, you can wipe it up easily and you can wet it and get it really smooth just the way you want it. Try to apply even pressure. So here's an example of where I got some caulk where I didn't want it, but this wipes up really easily when it's still wet. That's it, try to make it neat. So I'm gonna wet my finger and run it along the caulk. And if I need to clean off any excess, I'll just do that with my paper towel.
The job is now done. As you can see, it's nice, clean, white caulk all around the tub. Um, this didn't take too long. It took me maybe an hour, hour and a half. I spent more time prepping and cleaning than I did actually putting the caulk down. But as you can see, I did this with one tube of caulk and a few simple hand tools. So this is something that almost anyone can do at home. So if you found this video helpful, be sure to subscribe to the channel, give me a thumbs up, and leave a comment. God bless you all.